Hey guys, what is up? Zach here, or Blue Pancake, whichever one you guys call me. Um, this is part 10 of the Kingdom Hearts Final Mix walkthrough. So let's see. Last time we left off, Jane had gotten kidnapped, and we have to go see what the hell happened to her. I'm just gonna go up this one because last time I skipped this part of the vines. I went straight to the other side where Kerchak and the other gorillas were. Just looking around making sure there's nothing I'm forgetting to show you guys. Hmm. Let's go to vines too. I like how Donald and Goofy just refuse to come over here. Tarzan! Oh, there's Jane. That big black fruit looks suspicious. So all you have to do here is attack this fruit. You can lock onto it. Hitting the flower. <laughs> Thought I was hitting the fruit. Make you blossom, bitch. I still think something happens to these flowers. Let's attack some of the monkeys and get some XP. Fall in there. Come on. And there goes the fruit. Look like a giant eggplant. We know what would make it bloom. Every time I cast magic on it, it blooms. Oh, it turned blue. Hmm. See ya. I'm obsessed with these flowers. Must help the gorillas. I 
right, um, now that we saved Jane, I think... Hmm... I can't remember, I think you have to go to the cliff next, I'm not sure. I think there's one more flower too. I'm determined to see what happens when you make all the flowers bloom. When the, f when the heartless come near, they bloom black. It's like a useless piece of information. When you poop in your dreams, you poop for real. Blah, 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 blah. All right, um. I could have sworn there was one more flower. I think I'm going insane. I guess they really don't do anything. Heal up real quick. flowers. I just made them all bloom. Okay, so I think we have to go to... Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's the white mushrooms. What are they doing? I don't have stop yet. It's not my fault, dude. I don't have stop. Usually a lot more than just one. That's weird. Okie dokie, let's see where this lands us. Of course it does. Tarzan just loves to copy me. Okay, so I think we're heading to the cliff now. I think that's where you head to after you find Jane. Well, that's how you take a branch to the face three times. Look, I hit it, but nothing happened. I swear I think you can go that way. I just heal up the little stuff that I did lose. On that stupid vine thing. I mean the sliding thing. What is that thing? Oh my gosh. I don't understand. 
This is one of those new heartless. Pay attention. Oh shit. wasn't easy at all. No? Aw. Oh. It doesn't even let you and you lock on to him. I thought it would like... Oh wow. Check this out. Yeah, this is one of those new heartless. All right, onward to the battle. It's like a monkey war. No! Clayton! Not Clayton! <laughs> Not Clayton! He's speaking monkey like if Sora can understand him. I bet it pisses Sora off. Okay, so this fight's pretty simple. You start off fighting Clayton, and you just have to go like beast mode on him. Don't let him do anything to you, don't let him touch you. And you should be able to mess him up fairly easily. And then this cutscene will happen. Kazan tries to be a hero and gets owned. Alright, so now that he has this Heartless helping him, you just can't see it yet. You just have to keep attacking him, or the, the Heartless. It'll eventually reveal itself once you attack it enough. There you go, see? And you just have to keep attacking it until... Um, it'll drop Clayton. There you go. In the beginning of the fight, so you, you should try to dodge roll. Because he's gonna shoot you. I forgot to mention that. First thing he does when this fight starts with the uh, Heartless is he shoots you. So, you wanna take out the Heartless first. It's gonna be very difficult. With Clayton just shooting you in the background. But it's more difficult trying to take out Clayton with this thing running around shooting you with its eyeball lasers and taking you with its feet. attacking it until you start to see I mean it'll keep falling down and stuff it'll eventually too it'll pick Clayton back up I think it'll do that pretty soon actually because Clayton's been off of it for a while yeah look okay you gonna look at Clayton spit something at him and uh, Teleport him back onto it. Oh, 
but it's pretty easy just to make him throw Clayton off again and keep going at him. Then McDonald just came back to life and started going ice magic on him. This thing has a lot of HP. Either that or I'm just not doing any damage. Oh my gosh. The whole time Clayton is just healing himself. Yes, okay. Now you can just focus on Clayton. Which is stupid easy. Without that thing there. He'll jump around. But all you have to do is dodge roll your way to him and start going off on him with the key blade. He shouldn't even be able to get a shot off. Nope, can't heal yourself. Not gonna let you. He has more health than I thought. Thank you, Goofy. You probably would have shot me. Get him. Oh my god, Clayton, just die. Yes, finally. That was actually a much less brutal death than what Clayton suffers in the actual Tarzan movie, if y'all remember that. Finally, you get Cure, which is going to come in a lot handy, rather than always using potions. And what is your reward for saving the gorillas? Chirk uh, bleh. Kerchak sees fit or sees that it's fit to um proceed to pick you up and throw you Tarzan home. So now you're at Tarzan's home, and this is where the world ends. So I'll just walk into here, into the waterfall, and all that's in here really is a bunch of treasure chests, so just make sure you get all of them. I'm trying to get the camera behind me. There's like five or six chests in here, so just keep opening them. If you fall, I mean, it's not that hard to get back up, it's just annoying. So I would try not to fall. 
Make sure you always have a camera looking at where you're gonna jump so you know where you're gonna end up. And then question mark, question mark, question mark room. So is all pissed. Friends. He spent like Same three videos here in Tarzan's Clayton. world because he thought Kyrie and Riku were here. Heart. No heart. No see friends. No heart. No friends. Philosophy Sorry of a jungle dweller. What I said. I'm traveling through. Yeah, all for one, huh? Oh, that's good. Gummies are just coming out of everywhere. But it's sure not the kings. I think someone has a new admirer. No, 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 no. Did you repair me? Ooh, ominous music. It's the League of Doom. What drew the heartless to that world? The hunter lured them there. It was his lust for power that was the bait. But it seems the bait was too tasty for his own good. <laughs> yeah. He got chopped instead. Hmm. A weak hearted fool like him stood no chance against the heartless. But the boy is a problem. He found one of the keyholes. Fear not, it will take him ages to find the way. Besides, he remains blissfully unaware of our other plan. Yes, the princesses. They are falling into our hands one by one. Speaking of which... Oh, well now we know where Alice is. Yeah, you got your first keyblade. Or your fate, like your first upgrade for the keyblade. And you learned Red Trinity. Well, now that we're done with Tarzan's world, we're gonna have to go into the next, which means this video is over. And you're gonna have to check us out on next, on next, on the next one, which will be part 11.
So it's back to Traverse Town then, next time. Like, comment, subscribe, and see you later.